Hi viewers, today's topic, so I have come with a new topic, that is uh, effective mass of electron. That means when electron is uh, moving in a crystal which is having periodic potential, its mass, its uh, mass may be changed and it uh, depends on some other factors. So what, what uh, factor, what R factor it depends? What is its equation? So that is uh, we have to calculate now. Now check it here. See here. Let mass of the electron in periodic lattice. Periodic lattice is called effective mass of electron, right? And uh, let m star effective mass of electron can be shown with the m star. M star be the effective mass of electron when it is moving moving in moving in a crystal of lattice having periodic having periodic potential so when electron is moving in a crystal in a crystal of lattice so it may have the periodic potential so that periodic potential is explained in the chronic penny model so please watch that video then you can understand what is the periodic potential i explained them neatly right clearly next according to chronic penny model so this is things also taken from the chronic penny model only if you observe the text work so you cannot understand that is a very much a big now i am going to make this short form so that is why i am doing this video when a electron is uh, freely moving in the lattice, uh, its energy is uh, it is a kinetic energy. It's a moving means it may have a kinetic energy. Its energy is kinetic energy. Kinetic energy expression you have already know that is uh, E is equals to P squared by 2m. It is a uh, momentum. Kinetic energy in terms of momentum. And this is also taken from the chronic penny model. In the case, there are the two cases are there. So that is taken from the second case only. In the second case, this equation right so this is the uh, things about the uh, effective mass of electron so please uh, take a screenshot right and now see derivation so according to chronic technology it is taken like this once again, let me write E is plus P square by 2M star. And uh, P can be written as actually from, from D Broglie, D Broglie equation. What is D Broglie equation? Lambda is equal to H by P or in general H by MC. Lc for light only, Mv for object, for object, any object which is moving. But Mv for mass product of mass and velocity, velocity can be written as P only, momentum. I have seen this is the momentum, lambda is the center. Now here we have the P value, right? For this, P is equal to H by lambda. And uh, now I am going to change it. P is equal to H into 1 by lambda. Can we write? We write this. Multiply and divide the 2 pi on above and below. So 2 pi, it is also 2 pi. H by 2 pi can be written as H cut. And 2 pi by lambda is K. Right? Since H cut means H by 2 pi, K means 2 pi by lambda. Those two things taken. And substitute this equation in the equation this. Then what we get? E is E past. In the place of P square, H cut, K square by 2M square. H cut, K square by 2M square. I have now what we have to do, write it separately, E is equal to H cut square, K square by 2M star. So differentiating this equation,
equation with respect to k differentiate this equation with respect to k twice one and once twice so two time we have to differentiate first time d e by d k is equal so except k remaining terms all the terms are constant so here what we have k square k square can be written as 2k first differentiation 2 x square square k by 2 m star see k square is already in the nothing but x square x square differentiation is 2x see 2k like this 2 to cancel dp by dk is equals h square square k by m star again differentiate once again differentiate why twice you have to do once again so it is a differentiating once again d square e by d k square once again differentiation can be written as like this h square by m star h square square why you know it is a k k and with respect to k k differentiation is one x differentiation is one with respect to x like this right so this is what you think screenshot now what is that h cut sorry d square e by d k square is equals h cut square by m star so now bring m star this side and totally this side so this come upside and this come downside m star is equals h cut square by d square e by d k square so this is the equation for this is the equation for effective mass of electron right so then this is the friends so thank you